Hello and welcome to Construction Wolf. Uh, today is a nice big haul video, so around the Black Friday, the inside the weekend as well. Been ordering lots of, uh, you know, sort of sets with the good offers going. And uh, you can see I'm just sort of cramped in uh, onto the sofa here by this massive pile of boxes. And actually, uh, you can't even see the top of it, maybe you can see that in the thumbnail picture. But um, yeah, it goes all the way even higher up here. And uh, somewhere around the other side is the Wolf Keeping Cozy at the moment. Can't see him at all, but uh, hopefully when we get the boxes down, we'll see him. And there's Wolf snuggled in his brand new blanket that we got him for the 1st of December as it's uh, really cold outside, it's been snowing and it's um, I think below f uh, zero now, Celsius. You'll see he's got lots of little uh, festive dogs on there. It's pretty nice and it's sort of a nice um, sort of Sherpa lining. So you're very cosy in there aren't you Wolf? Right so I'm going to get the boxes down and then we'll start opening and see what we've got. Right I've just placed some of the boxes down for now so we can actually uh, easily access them. Uh, so the first then is actually an uh, order we picked up in a store uh, called Argos, uh, which is uh, you know sort of a catalogue. It was a catalogue shop in the UK, but now it's, um, it's just all online. They don't give out catalogues, but um, they just do a whole variety of things, and uh, they sometimes do have really good deals on sets. So uh, I think the Black Friday weekend, uh, which was uh, last weekend, uh, we picked up this set. Um, so I went down and collected it quickly before it went out of stock, which is the Lego Up House. So uh, there it is there, I'm going to give you a closer look. And um, this cost, uh, I'll just go down a bit. There we go, and that's the Lego Up House. And um, this was actually on offer. Um, it's normally £50 in the UK, but um, it was down to, um, what was it, £30. So a uh, really good deal, I think that's 40% um, off, if my maths is right. And um, you'll see here, just boxes in really good condition, so no issues there, because Argos can be a bit questionable sometimes. Um, with their boxes. Uh, they've got a little, you know, their little live off sticker there that we can just peel off, but really good deal in mint condition, so very happy with that. So just put that to one side for now. There we go. That's the carry bag that way. So actually, you might just say, uh, you popped up to have a look at this. So we might pop it as Dennis, so we're not blocking you. And then now we're going to get into this big uh, box here. So this box um, we ordered on inside the weekend, um, you know, as soon as it came um, available. Uh, so then they had like double points and um, had some really good deals on the set, so let's take a look at what we got. Right, okay then, so let's uh, crack this open. Always well, quite a, uh, there's a bit, of, a bit of a gap at the top, but um, they've got the gift of purchases in first. Uh, so firstly, um, if you spent uh, £60 or over on the uh, purchases uh, inside the weekend, you got this nice little, uh, looks like a little present doesn't it, a cool little gift set here. Uh, so then if we can actually quickly see what's in there. I'll uh, just pull, pull this tape off, just so you can actually see what's inside. There goes the tape off. It's really nice, uh, festive, uh, I don't know if you can see that. Festive design, quite a cool little box. Looks really nice. So I'll just crack this open. Try not to damage the box. There we go. So this was a little baking set that we were giving away with uh, certain themes. Um, I'll tell you the theme I've got at the moment to get that. You get this uh, nice little mug with a cool little uh, Lego gingerbread man and uh, you know the Lego sort of uh, tree limb elements and a snowflake. And then inside, um, if we just take this off, you get like little cookie cutters. It's so amazing, so you got like a little um, Lego tree limb element there. Then what else have we got? We've got a few more. Yeah, got like about four I think. We've got, uh, oh there you go, little Lego bricks. Got a little Lego gingerbread man and a Lego snowflake. So just a really cool little bonus thing to have. And I think it's nice they've done something a little bit different to just Lego. Uh, it's like, you know, something you could, um, you know, make as a family building and uh, making cookies and around to Christmas. So yeah, cool little bonus. Yeah. Right, I just popped the baking set away and you were interested in that when you were all fifth <laughs> checking that out. Right, so the next thing then, if you spent, I think, uh, 150 pounds or over, you've got this nice little, um, sort of a Lego Christmas winter market. This little winter market stall. So I'll just show you that there. And um, yeah, just I think it's a, a nice little thing to have, quite festive for the season. Uh, so just happy to get that through with the orders. I'll pop that down there as well. I that's going to uh, stand there. Angle it, there we go, I'll rearrange them in a moment. And then finally the free gift. Now this is if you spent uh, 220 pounds or over. Is uh, this uh, gift for purchase, which was uh, exclusive for the weekend? Think uh, it's uh, Magisto's magical workshop. 
Um, so we just saw the wizard. Uh, so this is like a reimagining of a set from the 90s um, that they've sort of done up a bit. It looks quite, um, you know, faithful to the original how they've done it. And um, actually, uh, we in the UK knew um, Magister as Merlin, so I still think of him as Merlin. Uh, I don't know if it's a license or thing, but I think in America he was known as Magisto and other parts of the world. Um, so I think that's uh, totally sold out now. And uh, it's just a really substantial set of uh, semi pieces are in it. Don't think it says here, but um, no, it doesn't say. But I think there's about 350 odd pieces in there, so really good for free to have. So pop that up there. You know, just balancing precarity there. And then, okay, the final thing then. Uh, so what did we buy to get all this uh, stuff for free? So I'm just going to get a box here. There's a, a box within a box. Right, I've got my box in a box out. So let's uh, seal that down and see what this is. Right, I finally uh, unsealed it with a bit of difficulty at that angle. So if we just take the top off here. And you'll see. We have... Oh, Ninjago uh, City Gardens. So uh, if I just lower that down so you can see it. Ugh. There you go, that's Ninjago City Gardens. So an absolutely massive set. And uh, let's see, I think there's about five and a half thousand pieces in this and almost 20 minifigures. Uh, so a really impressive set to have. I'm just gonna get it out of the box. So that's out of the box there. So it's a very impressive set, uh, stands really tall. And uh, they had such a good deal on, on the inside of the weekend, you could, um, you know, get uh, a voucher off the Insider uh, reward scheme. They, it didn't cost you anything to do that. And that was 20% off. So this was instead of 300 pounds was uh, 240 pounds. But in addition to that, you got a um, double Insider points. So that's equivalent to 10% off. So that's an extra 24 pounds back in Insider points. Uh, so that's like an you know, overall 84 pounds off. So imp impressive, an incredible deal. And then also we obviously got these um, free gift with purchases as well. Uh, free. So we've got, you know, the Magistus Workshop, the Winter Market Store, and then um, this, uh, to qualify for the baking set, £60 was on certain themes like Harry Potter, I think City, Ninjago was one of them, so uh, we're fortunate to get that as well. So um, an incredible deal on that weekend. Right, so I'm going to open the next set of boxes now. Right, as there's such a big boxes here, I've had a little bit of a rearrange now, and uh, hopefully we're in a more comfortable position to open the next box. So this was a second order we made on the same day, as we thought it's probably smarter to separate orders and maximise getting gift with purchase because they just give you a whole other set of gift with purchases if you are spending over the thresholds. So let's get inside. Right, there we go, that's all the, uh, the tabs off. So if we crack this open, so you'll see um, as before, we've uh, got the gift with purchase, got another Registered Magical Workshop. So that's when you spend over 220 pounds. And then, of course, if we spent that much, we must have got another winter market. So I think that's quite a nice uh, thing, you know, nice idea to have a, a couple of these winter markets. Because um, you'll see here, it's a, like a little toy shop uh, where they send like rockets and, um, you know, little trains. But potentially, you could, if you're making a winter village, you could actually, if you had multiple of these, change this up. And you could have maybe like um, a little stall selling like a hot chocolate or mulled wine or something. Just make your own little winter market. So I think that'd be quite good to have multiples of these. And then um, the smaller part of the order, so that's all our gift for purchases this time, because um, due to what we ordered, we didn't qualify for another um, baking set. Uh, so double points still on um, this uh, order. So we've got the uh, Lego Christmas tree. Uh, so, uh, so we've been thinking about it for a while, but for this year, let, let's do it, let's get it and uh, build it. And I think it'd be good for, we're starting to build the winter village. You could place that at the center of your winter village. It's a nice big sort of, Town tree, so we'll uh, build that in a later video, I think. <laughs> right, it's getting a bit crowded with boxes here now, so I've just uh, placed that there, and I forgot to say that was uh, forty pounds, but then we got uh, ten percent um, inside the points off that. And also, I will say we have tried to do, um, you know, like uh, cashback schemes, like top cashback, quick cut, etc. Uh, they haven't tracked, but I submitted the claim, and we'll see if that comes through. I'm not sure on that at the moment. So put this box aside. So um, what did we get to get, um, you know, these gift repurchases um, free? Because this was only £40. So I'm going to get the next box up. Right, so this is the big part of the order that we got to get over the threshold to get the gift repurchases. And um, this was actually delivered on uh, last week, uh, Friday the 24th of November. But you may notice this sticker here, the Eagle Eye Views Amongst You, um, if we get in closer to that.
but you'll see on the sticker just on top of the box, it says do not put on shelf before 1st of December. So um, we've been very fortunate to get this uh, a week early, but unfortunately I was away um, and only just got back uh, this week to look at these boxes. So let's pop it down and see what we've got. I'm sure many of you can guess what it might be. I'll get my scissors. Right, we're ready now. So let's put these scissors somewhere safe. There we go. Right, so what we have here, we can gently lift it out, hopefully it's the front, and it is. We have got the brand new Lego Natural History Museum modular building. So it's a very impressive uh, sized uh, build here. I think it's uh, the biggest modular building they've ever done so far, uh, uh, 4,014 pieces. So bigger than assembly square, and it covers one and a half base plates. Uh, just very lucky to get this uh, early. I'm not sure what happened there. I think maybe before Black Friday Lego for we're going to get absolutely uh, you know hit with a lot of orders. Let's just get some of these out now so we have a chance to get these orders out on time. Uh, but unfortunately, um, we've got to wait till Christmas to build this, haven't we? Because this is going to be a Christmas present. Uh, so um, we'll get this um, later this month now. So we can't build this yet, but we've got plenty to build at the moment. And let's just have a look at the back of the box. There you go, and you can see here that they've got the um, Natural History Museum with some of the other recent modular buildings, such as the Jazz Club, which we've got and actually we need to build, and then the Boutique Hotel as well. I'll just uh, flip it around the side, you can see it's got a nice range of uh, minifigures too. There we go, range of minifigures, and the uh, giant Brachiosaurus, which um, actually comes up uh, through into the second floor of the um, Natural History Museum. So I'm just going to have it rearranged now. Right, I've had to rearrange now and um, just about got everything in the shot. I've had to put the um, up house on my lap because it's uh, so many big boxes really. I will say that the um, the Lego Natural History Museum, um, we paid full price about £260. But um, you could pre-order it before the inside of the weekend, but we waited and uh, the good thing about that was we got double inside the points on this. So you get like, you know, it's essentially 10% off. So that's uh, £26 worth of points, so quite a lot to come back. And then also, um, as we waited, we also got the two really good um, gift for purchases as well. The um, Magisto's Magical Workshop, which I think Lego value about £25 on their website. And then the um, Winter uh, Market Store too, which is about sort of maybe £18. So it's a lot of money to get off, uh, so it's good to wait uh, to pre-order it. And um, we've got a lot of sets now to build, haven't we, Wolf? So hopefully we'll be building some of these in the uh, near future. And... Um, I would just like to say thank you to everyone for, you know, that's been continued to support the channel through liking and subscribing. Very much appreciated. And uh, hopefully we'll see you again soon on some of the later videos. Thank you for watching. Bye.